Well, how do there, chums? I'm back inside of Towers of Agasba, and I'm hitting up continue. Now, there has been another update to Towers of Agasba, and it's done a little bit of rebalancing, a little bit of jiggery pokery, made things a little bit simpler in places. But anyway, we're back on this bridge. I don't really want to be on this bridge. Where do I want to be today? Also, I don't want my camera set to be right there. So let's um, let's move myself up just under the Amity marker to about there. Okay, right, well, I'll sort out what I'm doing today, and I'll reconvene in a moment. Well, chums, I'm right there. There is a market here, just to the left of me over there. The Mystery of the Jabunga. We'll go and have a look at that, people. Okay, chums, now, this could be a little bit treacherous, because we all know how hard it is to get out of the water. Now, there's not many islands. I can only but hope that there's an island where this star is. And there is. There's a couple of little islands dotted about. I'm going to plan to swim across all these islands. I mean, there are quite a lot of pillars, but the pillars are going to be inordinate to climb. I mean, I could try climbing one, and then I could try gliding down to it rather than swimming, couldn't I? We could give that a go, but if I fall in the water here, I might have a little bit of a trek back. Let's give it a go. Okay, here we go. We're going to try and climb this. This is not a good idea. Okay, that did not work out well. And now I can't get out of the water. Okay. Let's swim around. Ah, ha, ha, ha. I'm out. But my stamina is rapidly declining. And I'm going to fall. And then I'm going to die, like, instantly in the water, aren't I? Insta-death. Yeah. That's what I was worried about. Okay, attempt number two. I'm just going to swim to that island and just hope I frickin' make it. Um, now, it'd be nice if I could glide some of the way. Let's see if I can climb up this and glide there. All right, let's give that a go, I think. Because at least if I fall here, I'm not going to frickin' die, am I? All right, okay, let's give that a go. Actually, you know what? Let's just climb to the top of one of these round things here. That might do the trick. If I can get all the way to the top of that, give that a go. But then again, if I fall and land in the water, you know what's going to happen. I'm going to die all over again, aren't I? So you know what? I'm going to make a save point right here, just in case something stupid happens to me. There we go. At least I don't have to start in the town like I did five minutes ago. Okay, chums, now that was freaking scary. I got it really high, run out of stamina and fell and nearly drowned because I couldn't get out of the freaking water and then this sort of stuff keeps happening. So this is not a good idea. Okay, I've just climbed to the top of this little one and I'm gonna jump and glide and then swim to that island there. Probably not be able to get out of the water and then I'm probably gonna drown. But we're gonna give it a go. Here we go, let's go, let's go. Oh my God, that didn't get me very far at all. Okay, come on. Come on, come on. I might just have to swim straight past this rock. Actually, there's a little bit, there's a little bit sticking out of the water. Hopefully I'm going to be able to get out of the water just fine. Getting in and out of water is a right git. Okay, I think we're okay. You. Okay, we've made it here. Oh look, there's a, that's the giant turtle from the trailer. Oh, this is cool. Okay, let's go. I wonder if that's the mighty Jujumba or whatever it is. I thought it'd be the flying creatures. Then again, this might just tell us about them. Okay, so it is swimmable, people. As long as you've got a decent amount of stamina. Well, hello. Yeah, I'm trying to talk to it. Um... Fly, fly, harvest. All right, let's let's harvest that then. Holy fudge! That nearly killed me. What the? F Why? Okay. Yeah. Hello. Okay. Now this is technically maybe a little bit spoilery when it comes to lore and stuff. So I'm going to watch this and I'll let you guys experience this yourselves. 
Okay, chums, well what just ensued there was a giant lecture about how shite humans were. I was really hoping for something mystical and magical. Oh, you're going to bring back, you're going to take out the Withered Lands. No, it's just banging on about how horrible humans are when we've got the Withered, which are far worse. And this whole thing of sorry or I'd do better. I don't know. Sweet. This means nothing. Well, why give me the freaking option? And why get into all this stuff? You know, it's trying to escape the world to play games and then this gets thrown in your face. Okay, cool anyway, rant over people. Okay, so they're talking about the Jabunga. I think it's the giant flying freaking whales. But well, there we go. We, apparently humans made them go extinct. Our fault again. And then, I'm sorry, apologising every five freaking seconds for stuff that was probably done by ancestors. No, I don't know. Yeah. Sorry, I'm feeling very ranty, but does my nut in when developers push agendas? Right, well, that's that one done. So I'm just going to hit a save here just in case I drown again. And uh, I'm going to have to take a look at the map. So we've done that one. I could go to that one, because that one's quite close, isn't it? I'm going to swim back to shore the way I came, though, because it's the shortest distance. And then we're going to trek round to there and see what's going on. All right. Oh, fudge, people. I've, I've kind of gone into some sort of withered realm over here. And um, that's not good. That's not good at all. I need to get out of here and get out of here quick. My donkey despawned and all sorts of stuff. I'm taking damage. And I'm dead. No warning, no nothing. Just, yeah, you're going to die. Back over here. So, you know what? I might as well go to the ones in the near here then. So look at that. And this ruin here as well. Okay. All right. So we've got a few bits and bobs. We'll go to those then. Fun times. All right. Well, we've got one that's got a star here. We've got to go to all these star locations for the current mission that we're on, including one all the way over there. Okay loads to visit and before i go back to that withered lands i need a full energy bar all right cool yeah i've just spoken to her and she says that the doda or dada should be able to make an elixir that allows you to travel through the withered haze but we need to construct an alchemy building to do that within the bounds of midhaven okay all right so we might have to do that journey into the withered lands before we go back over there and do that last Jabunga. All right, okay. Well, at least that makes a bit more sense. Okay, chums, I just tried swimming over there and I entered into the Withered Lands again. It's very hard to tell when you're gonna enter into the Withered. So I'm gonna try swimming all the way over there and then getting out of the water, but we'll see if this works. It might be that I need to do the Withered missions first to get these elixirs or whatever. But, um, yeah not the greatest it won't get out the bricking water again oh we're out of the water thank fudge for that i thought i was gonna die there oh for fudge sake okay right okay we're on the shore without warning again i've gone into the withered and i think i'm taking damage now I need to get out of the withered area, but there's no way of seeing the boundaries between one reality and another, is there? So this is this just gets really difficult. I don't know when I'm gonna. I'm dead, freaking dead. I think what's needed is some sort of amulet or some sort of item that, when you go to the map, you can turn on and see withered zones. Because at the moment, I don't know whether I'm... You know, I've just spent ages travelling all the way across here. Well, there's a teleporter right there. I couldn't get to it because it's in the Withered Zone. So, it'd be nice to know where the Withered Zones are with some sort of magical amulet. Just saying. Right, I've got a lot of missions here. So, I've just selected Journey to the Withered Lands. Build an alchemy building. That's probably what we're going to have to do first. We're also going to meet Hoa. Now, I have heard that there is po it's possible to get a sword, and apparently Hoa gives it to your latter game. So let's hope that that's, that's what's going to happen. So we go, let's... Oh, is this the shrine right here? That's the notice board. Why is it put a marker there then right now? Let's go and have a quick look anyway. Okay, yeah. 
Complete the Wyvern Expedition. Yeah, I get it. That's, that's kind of what I want to do. All right, fine. Sweet. Let's do that then. Coolio. Let's have a look at the old uh, map to see where I've got to go to. And where's the one with the star on it? Right, yeah, don't give me one with a star on. That would have made things a little bit freaking easy, wouldn't it? And it can't be all the way over on the opposite island, surely. No, no, it's not. That just means I've got the mission active there. All right, so is it this one here then? No, that's Regrowa Gaspar. Mystery of the Chibunga. Midhaven upgrade. Ah, oh, this is... Seriously? Okay, yeah. well, there isn't actually a marker because you've got to read the bottom all the way down there. It says build the alchemy building. The alchemy building can be built within Midhaven from the build menu. Build out. There we go. There's lumber milled. I've got to build a lumber mill first, though. Right, so that means I've got to go get some limestone. I have no idea where to get limestone from. Okay, all right. Fair enough. Uh, yeah, I've got to do the lumber mill before I can get to the alchemy. Well, this is really weird. I just hit build anyway, and you know what? It it just popped up and started working. I haven't got the components to build this, so that's pretty darn weird. All right, I've got to find a place to fit put my lumber mill. Now, I'd imagine the lumber mill is something that I'm going to be visiting often, so I want to put it near to the teleporter. So let's, let's do that then. So craft, well, it's build menu, wasn't it? Just choose it, let's you put it down. And I'm going to rotate it round so it's facing me, like so, I think. Okay, why is it not letting me put it down? It went blue a second ago. Okay, let's put it a little bit further then. Inadequate flooring. Oh, for fudge's sake. All right, I'll reconvene once I manage to find how I can stick this blasted thing down. It's not where I wanted it, but there we go. We can stick it down. Again, a little bit like the withered zones. It'd be nice if it if it was a little bit more precise and where you could put things, you know. Same with the, the seeds, putting them down. It'd be nice if it highlighted all the areas you could put it. Rather than just bing bong, bing bong. Because that noise really frustrates you. Okay, well, I can put the gold dust in. Let's get that in. Lovely jubbly. And let's press R3. Limestone, usually found near mountains and cliffs. Okay, all right. Let's go on a little jaunt. Right, well, we've got lots of mountains here. So let's... um. Let's head on over and let's see if we can find anything around here. Because this is very cliffy and mountainy. Oh, well, I've got a stick. Doesn't quite count as limestone. I'll let you know if I find any. <laughs> limestone boulder. Yes, just at the foothills of this mountain. Oh, great. I broke my blinking pickaxe. Right, let's, uh, let's craft another one. Now, they were going to be making the durability of your tools a lot better, but let's see. There you go, Yeah, That's one limestone. Let's hit this one. And in the patch notes, coming up soon, they're going to have a hold to um, harvest. Okay, that didn't go as well as I hoped. Okay, and I'm not seeing many other rocks I can smash. Okay, is this one of those jump stones? Yeah, I don't really fancy smacking that because that launches you up into the air. There's lots of these jump stones around, though. Here we go. Here's a whole nest of them. Let's slap these. Stone boulder. Oh, we got some flint. Good. I might be able to craft some more arrows. We're getting low on arrows. Take that. Yeah, we've got limestone. There's another limestone. Take that, limestone! Die! Yeah, cool. There we are. Just a normal stone boulder here. Don't know whether standing on something you're harvesting is the best idea. Okay, cool. And it looks like they've upped the quantity of flint, because that stuff was as rare as rocking horse turd. Now I'm getting quite a fair bit of it, which is good. Might as well go around, harvest a few more flint stones, if I can. 
Flintstones, meet the Flintstones, have a yabba dabba do time, a yabba do time, have a gay old time. Heck yeah. I also need some more wood, so cut down a few trees. Here we go. Ah, lovely jubbly. Not finding much more Flintstones around here, to be honest. Bit of a shame. Okay, there's another tree. Go on, tree. Down you go. And I think this might be another limestone. Yes, sweet. They're also going to make it so it automatically swaps to whichever tool to harvest. So you don't have to keep going in and out of menus, which is going to be a very welcome addition. That should be coming in about I don't know, a week or two, perhaps. Sweet. Because, yeah, doing this over and over, it's a little bit tedious. OK, more wood. OK, well, I can see that I've got enough wood and I've got a lot of limestone, so I can head on back now. That's a nice little tip. Just access your map and go and look at what's required to see if you've got enough before you head all the way back. Here we go. I love this bit. This kind of makes all the other little frustrations worthwhile. When you see your town come to life, or you build your tree up, and you see all the growth around it, that's oh, it's just bloody brilliant. It really is. It's such a novel idea, and that's why I'm sticking with this. I just, I just love how unique this game actually feels. Okay, so we've got a lumber mill now. Ah, that's how you make the wooden planks. Oh, fair enough. Okay, cool. Pretty darn nice. Uh, so I can make a load of wood out of sticks now. Oh, that's going to make things a heck of a lot easier. Right, anyway, let's go to the build menu now. Because now we can move on to this. I need clay. Oh, you know what? I saw a load of clay. You know, when I died in the water, when I got killed by the wither, there was a load of clay over there. That's such a long way to go to get it, though. Oh, well, well I can put down the blueprints for it. And I'm going to put this, I think, fairly close to this structure, I hope. OK, let's um, rotate it round. I'm not seeing where the entrance is on this one. Aha, I think that's the entrance there. So maybe I just need to move it just a tad. OK, come on. Oh, for fudge, really? Might as well just stick it wherever it goes blue, even if the entrance isn't where I want it. You know what, let's put this one over here at the opposite side of the staircase. Oh, it's moving so slowly. Aha, there's the staircase right there. So I want it. Something's in the way. Yeah, always bloody is, isn't it? Oh, OK. It just went blue for a second there, didn't it? That's going to have to do. There we are. And then the museum's going to be over there. So I'm building towards the museum. So this, I think this works quite nicely. Right, so we can put the gold dust in and the stone. The only thing then we need is the clay. Back at my previous island, I remember seeing clay there as well. But let's see if it gives us a hint as to where we can find clay. Usually found near water bodies. Yeah. OK, I don't really want to go near to the water near here because it's all frickin' withered land. So I'm going to use my teleporter to go back to my previous area. And that little fishy nook that I've gone to before, I'm sure I've seen clay around there. Let's go all the way back here. There we go. Ah, I found iron boulders. I got iron. Not what I was after. But we might be able to start crafting some iron tools now that I've found these. Pretty darn handy. But this is the body of water that I was near to. That I'm, I'm sure I saw clay. Aha! There we go. That could be clay down there. Here we go. Let's harvest that. I'll show you where I am on the map in a second. Okay, right, I'm going to craft myself a new spade. Inventory is full. Man! Okay, I'm going to scrap a few things. Now, I've put on a new mask, but I don't want to scrap that. I'll scrap this, maybe. Can I scrap it? Yeah, I'll scrap that. What else can I scrap? Because it all goes into this scrap pile. 
So I, I haven't seen any use for feathers yet. So I'll scrap all of them too. Might as well. What else can I scrap? I haven't been asked. Oh, okay. That gives me moderate health. I'd eat that. There we go. All right. Let's uh, start harvesting this then. Stone shovel required. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I've got to craft one. All right. Craft and yes. Yes, please. Righto. And we're getting ourselves a load of clay. Now, if you want to know where I am, here I am on the map. I'm all the way down here. Freaking miles away down here. Lovely, lovely clay. Let's get some more. Again, I can see that I've got enough clay now, so now I can go and head all the way back. Oh, chums, look what I've just spied. I've spied some giant stone Buddha statue. I'm going to go and check that out while I'm here. Uh-oh. Sounds like spider monsters are after me. Let's just get all the way up here. Let's just hope they don't follow. I want to look at this thing. Uh-oh. I'm hearing, like, scary noises. I'm going to climb this. Let's get on top of its head. All right, well, that seems like a pointless exercise. Interesting, nonetheless. Don't know why it's here. Oh, fudge, there's a load of trees I could cut down right there as well, isn't there? All right. Anyway, I'll see you back at my other town. Holy fudge, chums. Look, I've got some sort of giant giraffe thing in, in this place. Wow. That is so majestic and cool. What are you? Oh, wow. Okay, rescan him. Let's have another look. What is it? Wow. Okay, that's cool. It eats lettuce. Wow. That's awesome. Okay, while I'm here, I'm just going to have a look, see if there's anything I can do for this chap over here. I've got no amity whatsoever. Okay. Sweet. Seeds planted from, from other ecosystems. Okay. Can I... Okay. Let's have a look, see if I've got any seeds that I could plant from another ecosystem on me. I don't think I do. What's this thing? Don't know. Oh yeah, right. No, I don't. I don't have any of those. Right. Well, let's just equip these anyhow. And you know what? I'm just going to throw them around. Sa. There you go. Eat up creatures of creatureness. There we are. Hopefully, I get a bit of amity before I leave here. Is what I'm thinking. Could get some dung as well, maybe. There we are. Done. And I might as well throw out all the other things that I don't really use, like this. I know that that little guy he eats them, so... I'll throw those around as well. Cool. And then hopefully, uh, as I'm just moving around in here, hopefully I get a bit more amity. Sweet. There we go. Are you going to do a poo for me? Oh, we've got a tropical seed. Right, well, I might as well plant them, then. Well, where are they? Ah, oh, there they are. Sweet. One. Two. And... Come on, let me put the other one near these ones. I don't want to lose these. Oh, just... I wish it would show all the areas where you can bloody plant them, you know? Oh, can't sustain any more plants. All right. That's my own fault for not reading the screen, isn't it? And I'll put the fertiliser around here somewhere. Where's those two mounds I just did? It'd be nice if it highlighted things better for you, you know? Oh, there you go, there's one. It must be around here somewhere then. Kaboom! What's this on the floor? Fresh egg. Sweet. We've got big caps. Nice. There we go. Right. So that egg. I might. I might eat. Uh, I might eat that egg. Wherever it's gone. I'm sure I just picked up a fresh egg. I must be mistaken. All right. Cool. Well, that's that then. Anyway, let's get out of here. Oh, I've got it in my hand. I'm going to eat it. There we go. 
Well, now I've got a load of flint, I can make a load more arrows. Um, I died. A creature killed me around by my tree, one that I haven't seen before. I was scanning it while it was biting me. Right, okay. Well, that was fun. Okay, well, now I'm back here. I should be able to just teleport back to my other base. If I can spot the bloody teleporter. There it is, right there. Okay, see you soon. Okay, let's go and stick the clay in. Let's see how we get on. Brilliant! I guess. Well, I like the curly whirly little ladder going up there. I, I I really hope that they do make some interiors, just just for whimsical appeal, you know. But anyway, let's go speak to this lady. Hello, Dada. Sweet, you're most welcome. Now we can make elixirs. Hopefully, I can then go into the withered. Funky. <laughs> Withered Protection Elixir. Yes, we could do with some of that. I've heard Hoa is out exploring the Withered Lands. Could you deliver this elixir for her protection? Still what about my protection, that. mate? Okay, cool. Sure, not a problem. We'll be doing that next episode, people. We've done quite a lot of this episode. It's been quite frustrating, this episode, I have to say, peeps. Yeah! Sorry about the old rant with the old turtle, but after I saw that big turtle creature in the trailers, I was like, oh, very never-ending story. Oh, this is going to be awesome. Fantastic Mondo. And then you get there and get a whole lecture about humans are bad. Oh, great. Well, uh, guess what I am? I'm a freaking human. It, it'd be nice to acknowledge that humans done some damage, but now the Wyvard have made it worse, and only humans can now take care of the Wyvard and slowly undo the wrongs. There was none of that. It was just a massive, great big rant about horrible, how horrible humans are, which, yeah, was a little bit, yeah. I will be doing a review of this game, and at some point I'll probably have that reflected in there, inside of it all. But there we go. I just found it a bit preachy. And then I come here and I preach to you. It makes me just as bad as the bloody turtle, doesn't it? But anyway, I need to go make a cup of tea, and... um yeah, I'll come back and hopefully we'll go and find Hoa next episode, people. And hopefully go into the Withered Lands. Salute to Mondo. Goodbye, goodbye. And goodbye again. Captain Steve, Captain Steve.